match for me once I get into things. I think I'll begin by taking down Hong Jong. We should be able to exert pressure on the enemy's main camp. Just roll right over! This base is ours! Time for your punishment! Shoe forces? Here? My heart nearly stopped with the shock! Oh, why? Are you alright? Not coughing too badly today? I'm here now, so you can relax. We must! Take to the defenses of the surrounding area! Alright, let's go take that area over there! The plan has failed. How could we fail to claim a single, measly base? I found a rather perfect location for us to occupy. That is our destination. Forces at bay. Then it is time for us to turn to the attack. I, I can fight as well as anybody when backed into a corner. Well, I must say. If you need me.
impressive. Take you to a really nice place. Let's start the advance, shall we? I hope you're prepared to die. Gotcha. Now, hands are the way, forces. A pizza attack? Double! Oh, Anyone! Help! Ah! Ah! them out so nicely! But it turns out we couldn't finish them off. You fight as well as anybody when backed into a corner. UNG, you never cease to amaze me. Time for your punishment! I hope you're prepared to die! I can fight as well as anybody when backed into a corner. We were but a step away from slaying Zhao Shuang. I'm so frustrating. That was a surprisingly close run thing. But in the end, naturally, my superior skill prevailed. Must say. Wow, you have that certain aura that surrounds great warriors. The wave forces are closing in. Stay calm and fight back. One of our important positions is under men. We must aid in its defense before it is too late. I hope you're prepared to die! I hope you're prepared to 
too many people that I would survive this battle. So, I guess this is goodbye. I can fight as well as anybody when backed into a corner. to amaze me.
Impressive. All right. I need everyone to defend this area. You're becoming a new soldier. How could my tactics fail like that? I can fight as well as anybody when backed into a corner. are simply amazing in battle! Watch yourselves, Wei Dogs! We are not giving Hanzhong over to you! Managed to make it as far as Hanjong. Do not let the soldiers rest, no matter how much they complain. As soon as our battle ranks are reformed, we will attack Chengdu. Grand General, I have to report that the stronghold up ahead is well defended by the forces of Shu. It will be almost impossible to take down. On top of that, our supply lines to the rear are stretched dangerously thin. If we sustain an enemy raid, we run the risk of losing our supply route from Xiong An and being isolated. Silence! How dare you speak to your Grand General like that? You just want me to withdraw my forces so that I won't be able to claim the glory that is rightfully mine. No, that's not it at all. Master Cao Shuang, I must agree with Master Sima Shao. Our soldiers and steeds are fatigued and injured. To fight on would be mere folly. Gah. Even you would say such things, Sha Ho Shuen? Huh. Well, this was all a test. That's right. I was testing you. And it seems our men are a bunch of weaklings. There is no point in sending them any further. Order all forces to retreat. Everyone is to retreat to Luoyang at once. Thank you for the help, Master Shao Shuan. It seems you managed to convince him. I apologize for any inconvenience caused, Master Sima Zhao. Master Cao Shuang is simply desperate to regain his clan's lost glory. I know. But this retreat is going to end up damaging his reputation still further. That cannot be helped. Were it not for yourself, your lord brother, and a handful of other capable officers. This battle could have had a much worse outcome. The Kingdom of Wei, Master Cao Pi and Master Cao Rui built, is now being threatened by their descendants in the Cao clan. Something must be done before Wu or Shu takes advantage. There are still those near the Cao clan, such as yourself and Xiao Ba, who are determined to use their talents for the benefit of the kingdom. As long as Master Cao Chuang refrains from more overt foolishness of this type, we should be fine. Come, we need to get back to Luo Yang. Yes.
Father, there is something I would like to talk to you about. Ever since his defeat at Mount Xingxi, the Grand General has wasted his time and money on wanton debauchery. The economic resources established by the previous Emperor are being drained rapidly, and we can barely maintain our defenses against Wu and Shu. It is dangerous to allow him to rule any longer. Dangerous? What are you saying, brother? You think we should remove Cao Shuang and seize power for ourselves. You realize that is a double-edged sword, do you not? It is true that Cao Shuang presents a threat to our nation from within. But there are still many who are loyal to the Cao family because of Cao Cao and Cao Pi. To depose Cao Shuang is likely to incur the wrath of those loyalists. At worst, it could lead to civil war. We need to be prepared if we take that path. Brother. I have always been prepared. Pouncing on the opportunity provided by what happened at Mount Xingxi, Shu has made its move. We will be at war within a few days. We must remove the disease, eating away at the heart of our kingdom before then. My lord, I hear that the Grand General is away hunting at the moment. Perhaps now would be the most opportune moment? Hmm. This could be our best chance, with Cao Shuang and the others away from Luoyang. We must move quickly. Head for the palace at once. Master Sima Shi is said to be leading troops towards the castle. My friends, do you suppose? Yes. Master Sima Shi is finally making his move. This is the moment we have all waited for for so long. Ever since his return from Mount Xingxi, Master Cao Shuang has done nothing but indulge his own baser instincts. His waste of our valuable taxes cannot be overlooked. Despite the fact that Shu is showing signs of preparing to attack us, our leader wastes our military budget on his own gratification. I've been so worried that Shu might attack at any moment that I can feel what remains of my life slipping away all the time. <laughs> Everyone, Master Sima Shi wants to see you. You all know why, I take it. Understood. We will go to him at once. Even if it drains the last of my life, I will do what I must to keep this kingdom safe. I owe everything I have to Master Sima Yi. In order to repay that debt I owe, I will carry out my mission. You have chosen wisely, gentlemen. We must head for the palace at once. This must be done before the general returns from his hunt. Thank you for coming, everyone. The Grand General, Master Cao Shuang, is currently away from Luoyang on a hunting trip. We intend to take this opportunity to strip him of his powers. Brother, I know Cao Shuang is unfit to lead, but don't you think there might be a subtler way of doing this? You need to show more commitment, Zhao. The decay at the heart of our kingdom cannot be removed by adopting half measures. This is a step that we must take if we truly wish to bring peace to the land. It is our destiny. I see. Good. We will seize Luo Young before Cao Shuang returns. We must quickly capture Luo Young. Then we will be able to slay Cao Shuang outside the castle walls.
the palace. If you do not leave now, I will cut you down where you stand. All right. I need everyone to defend this area. We have to retreat. We are powerful foe today, Sima clan. Traitors, how could I not have enough to overcome you? I have claimed control of the palace. Cease your futile resistance at once. I can fight as well as anybody when backed into a corner. We did well, I must say. I wish I had a daughter like you instead of my sons. For the youth of Lord Sao Shuang, no rebels may pass through it. I hope you're prepared to die. Report: We've lost multiple lords. The Luoyang Palace now belongs to Sima Yi. Castle. No, we cannot allow them to run rampant any longer. For Lord Sao Shuang. Here we go! I can hold this place no longer. Lord Sao Shuang, my deepest apology. We did well. I must say. Most impressive. Report! Master Yin Damu is defeated. Some of the gates have been closed up. to take a detour just to get into Luoyang? How dare you make me go to such trouble? Have faith, Lord Sao Chuang. I will defeat Sima Yi and his henchmen at once. Simai, to attack while I was gone. This is an act of cowardice, as well as high treason against the Kingdom of Wei. Now, take defensive positions. I'll take you to a really nice place. Let's start the advance, shall we? over that area. Time for your... You and 
indeed. You never cease to amaze me. I must fall back. I can fight as well as anybody when backed into a corner. Most impressive. Anybody when backed into a corner. Hey, on the house of Sima, you wish to seize the glory that is rightfully ours. So you have yet to understand the true nature of our plans? Zhao Shuang, you fool! We are taking you to Shu Chong! Yi, do you really think that you will get away with doing this? You're a minister of Tao Wei, and you dare raise your hand to it me? It is because I am a minister of Tao Wei. Mm -hmm. The great lord Zaza laid the very cornerstones to build Tao Wei. The wise Tao Pi built the foundation. I've served three generations. No. Four generations. And I have done everything I can to ensure that it would always prosper. And I will not allow a fool like you to ruin everything that we've built and worked for. You must seek the forgiveness of my lords Cao Cao and Cao Pi. When you finally meet them in the afterlife. Traitors! You dare to usurp my throne! Usurp, you say? Perhaps there really is no other way than that. Lord Shahoba, terrible news! Lord Xiao Shuang and Lord He Yan have been found guilty of the crime of treason and have been executed by Lord Sima Yi! What? what I mean, I know Master Xiao Shuang made his fair share of mistakes, but the death penalty? It seems incredibly harsh. Yet I suppose the fact that there's no great unrest in Luo Yang in response shows just how far the Cao clan star has fallen. It looks like the Sima are the new leaders of Wei. That's not all. Lord Shaho Xuan has also been sentenced to death for siding with Lord Cao Shuang and conspiring to plot an overthrow of the government. Master Shaho Juan? But he didn't do anything. They're just trying to get rid of anyone with ties to the Cao clan. This is just outrageous. But it does seem like the kind of thing Master Sima Shi would do. Ah, uh, things are looking seriously grim now.
Master Shahoba. I'd like to inform you that I've been assigned to assume complete command of the Shu campaign. <coughs> okay, I'm listening. It is unfortunate about Master Shuang. I hope, Master Ba, that we can work together somehow to gain merit and earn the trust of Master Sima Shi. <coughs> No, no, no! It's not going to be that simple! <sighs> Juan suffered for Lord Sao Chuan's mistake. Someday it could be my turn! Um, after how many? It's no good. It's no good. It's just... Uh, I never thought that I would have to worry about my life outside of a battlefield. Uh, Come to think of it, didn't they say my cousin married Zheng Fei of Shu? <laughs> no, no, no! I can't ask them for any help. I mean, it was Shu that killed my father! <sighs> but still, I have nowhere else to go. Yeah, it's no good worrying about it. It couldn't be any worse. Let's head for Shu. Shao Ba has defected to Shu. Master Sima Shi had Sao Shuang's cousin, Shao Xuan, executed. It appears he decided that his familial ties made him an unstable element. Xiao Ba must have seen that and decided that he could be next. Perhaps my brother has gone too far. Yes. Much as it pains me to say. <laughs> you are both too soft. Master Sima Shi made the only decision he could make. Certain groups within the kingdom view the Sima clan as usurpers for their role in the Sao Shuang incident. It is quite possible that they may initiate an uprising. It is far better to eliminate such a threat before it makes itself known. But doesn't that mean we are abusing our power? Doesn't that make us the same as Sao Shuang? No. Master Sima Shi has talent and vision that Sao Shuang never had. He holds the future of Wei in the palm of his hand. Which is precisely why there are those who fear and hate him. For now, that is true. But it is only a matter of time before they realize Master Sima Shi's true worth. You must not waver. You must support your brother unflinchingly. If you do not, you will lose him. I don't like the sound of that. I guess I need to pull myself together. If you know what you have to do, it's time to show it with your actions. We must speak with Master Shi about the future. By slaying Cao Shuang, the Sima clan has seized control over the Imperial Court. There will obviously be those who object to this. Why must there be so many who are ignorant of their own mediocrity? Just like those who are jealous of my talents. Master Zhang Hui, that's enough. You always make everything about you, don't you? Hmm. Then we must begin by shutting those objectors up. After that, we will get rid of Zhao Feng and install Master Zhao Mao in his stead. Shi, at the current moment, you are still merely a man who stole Zhao Shuang's position and took his place. And now, you wish to replace the Emperor as well? To an outsider looking in. You are no different than Dong Zhuo. 
You feel that Master Cao Mao will make for the ideal emperor. Have you managed to convince everyone else of that goal? I can. If I were not confident of my ability, I would never have killed Cao Shuang in the first place. <laughs> in that case, there is nothing left to say. Xi, if you feel you can make this happen, then by all means, do so. My lord, 